This video showing a woman losing weight after consuming a glass of hot water mixed with the juice of half a lemon and half a teaspoon of coffee powder and showing this as a doctor's suggestion is being shared on social media platforms. Other social media posts and videos make similar claims. According to a Harvard study, drinking four cups of coffee a day could reduce body fat by 4%. A co-author of the study opines that this could be because of the caffeine in coffee, which increases metabolism and helps burn more calories, thereby decreasing body fat. However, a metabolic health physician and clinical professor of medicine at NYU School of Medicine has said that no doctor they know would ever recommend this as a way to lose weight because such a caffeine boost to the body will be short-lived as the body will soon begin to tolerate the high level of caffeine. A 2008 study proved the effect of lemon polyphenols in fat reduction, but this was performed on mice and no studies proved lemon's efficiency in human fat reduction. A USA-based registered dietitian nutrition told Time magazine that lemon water is not a miracle weight loss food and that it can help in reducing body fat indirectly as adding lemon to plain water could encourage people to drink more water by which they would stay hydrated which counters thirst-triggered food cravings as thirst is often misunderstood for hunger. Another registered dietitian says that there is nothing in lemon juice to burn fat or a chemical connection to make that happen. She added that water keeps you fuller, which works to keep down hunger cues that make you want to eat. Healthline.com states that neither lemon nor coffee can melt fat. The article emphasizes that the only way to lose weight is by consuming fewer or burning more calories. As there is no credible evidence that drinking coffee with lemon helps shed fat, this post and others that make similar claims are misleading. When you come across a piece of news that seems too ridiculous to be true, don't leave things to doubt. Run searches on Google and Yandex and weigh out the true and false of the situation for yourself by looking at the facts. But first of all, before you hit that forward button, pause.